door. If there is just you in this moment in a state of this is Yeshua, in a state of self acceptance, which activates unconditional love of yourself which allows you to see that in this moment you are doing the very best that you can. And if you start to argue with yourself about that, check in, see if an adjustment can be made. Okay, perhaps this, I could tweak. But more often than not, if you're arguing with yourself about this, that you are doing the best that you can, you are projecting onto yourself an ideal about what it is you think you are supposed to be experiencing as a human based on a set of programs that you took on as a young person in this life and you are not living in that reality any longer. The world has changed dramatically since the winter solstice of 2012. Each one of you, each piece of humanity is in the process of this massive shift and integrating your higher selves, your fifth dimensional consciousnesses into the density of your third dimensional containers, especially your lower energy centers. The more you can put your attention on your heart, access your fifth dimensional identity, right there from within, breathe into it, exhale it down into the soles of your feet, allowing your higher self to connect more directly with planet earth, the more you will always feel and know inherently that you are on your path. Yes, this is the Pleiadians and this Pluto retrograde period will be a wonderful period of time for you to do this practice that Yeshua just gave you. Really feeling your connection to the world, to humanity and recognizing you're on your path. You have always been on your path. You always will be on your path. And you don't live in the world that the generations before you lived in. You are living in a different reality and things are going to continue to change. They're going to change really at an accelerated rate as they already have. And as those changes occur, you cannot project onto those future moments the reality of the past and experience joy because you're moving forward into the great unknown, every single one of you into a reality that has not existed here on planet Earth before. In this life, you're doing this. You're already doing it. It's already happening. The shift is occurring. You're in it. You're living it. You're breathing it. You're walking it. You're working it. And as you change your physical circumstances, some of you as a response or reaction to what was not working for you, you start to lay that physical foundation and pathway for those who will follow. And that puts you in your identity as an agent of change. 